Welcome you 12 to another revision video. The um, chapter 2 networks. This is the chapter revision uh, starting on page 94. This is uh, three of the short answer questions. <coughs> so let's have a quick look. So we've got uh, finding the degree of the following vertices. So degree is the one where you have to count the edges coming off the vertice. So P is here, and there's uh, two vertices attached to P, so the degree is 2. For Q, we've got uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 5 going into Q, degree of 5. R is here, and looks like 1, 2, 3 going into R. S. S is here. We've got two coming from Q, one from T and one from U. So that's one, two, three, four. T is there. And we've got one coming from U, one from S, one from Q, and one from R. So that's one, two, three, four. And F is for U. That's only got two, one, two. So there's our degrees of the um, vertices in this one. This network diagram for question two has six vertices, all lettered. A to F. What is the degree of each vertex? Oh, I need a bit of space for this one. So let's do A. A only has a degree of one. B has a degree of two. C has a degree of 1, 2, 3, 4. D has a degree of 2. E has a degree of 1, 2, 3, 4. And F has only 1. There we go. Okay. Why does this graph have an Eulerian trail? And we need to find, just to give you an idea, Eulerian trail exists if the graph is connected, which it is, and has exactly two vertices with an odd degree. Well, we've got that. We've got vertice A is 1 and vertice F is 1. So it has two vertices of odd degree. Exactly two vertices with an odd degree. List an Eulerian trail. Okay, I'll do that in. We'll start here, go A to C, to E, and go to D, because we only got allowed to do one edge, each edge once. E to D, D to B, B to C. And we've got this handy little one here, going C to E again, but on a different edge. And then find E to F. There we are. There's our Eulerian trail. This one, this new one here, has six vertices, just like this one. What's the degree of each vertex? Okay. Uh, start with A. Do it alphabetical. It has a degree of two. B looks like it's one, two, four. Uh, C is two. D has one, two, three, one, two, three, four. E has 
one, two, three, four, and F has two. Okay, why does this graph have an Eulerian circuit? Meaning that you have to do the same as an Eulerian trail, one at each vertice once, but you've got to start and stop on the same one. And that requires every vertice is even for this one. And it looks like it is. So every why does it? Because every vertice is even. So you gotta have that for Megadonoid Erin circuit. Okay, let's I think we're gonna start over in F. Doesn't really matter. So we're going to list the circuit. F to D. We're going to go C. Then we'll get uh, to B. Then we'll get to A. And then we'll go to E. And then we're going to go to B. Yep, I think we're okay, still okay. Then D. Then back to E. And finally go back to F. There we are. Well, they're in circuit. Each edge once. Start and stop on the same one. Thank you.